So I guess I just have to drive it there. That's what it looks like. All right, guys, we just made it to the Freedom Factory, unloading everything. We got a couple trucks that just showed up. Uh, we got this guy who I beat and won a lot of money from. He's bringing his turn. And then we got, I beat him too. I got a lot of money there. Brian's down there. He's going to get drugged. This is going to be great. I can't wait. Hey, how you feeling, man? Great. Great. Hey, why you got all these dipsticks, bro? What, what's all this for? All this stuff. Those little guys? I wouldn't worry about those. Yeah, don't guys. worry about those little guys. I ain't even going to pop my hood. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh, that's pretty fancy. That's good. So we are getting everything unloaded. We're going to get everybody teched in, registered. I'm doing the tech so I can tell who's cheating or not and uh, get everybody uh, lined up and ready to pull. <laughs> All righty. Garza, I heard you almost hit the wall. <laughs> I guess we're doing a parade lap. That's what I hear. That's what I'm, that's what I'm hearing. So doing some kind of parade lap here. So you ready for the big braid lap? Oh yeah, big braid lap guy here. I thought we were racing. I was like, oh crap, we're guys, we're gonna be late. And I realized we're just doing a braid lap, so. All right, so just realized I didn't really explain what we're doing in the video today. Most of you guys might know. Some of you guys watched on the on the uh, live stream, whatever. But here's the deal. Um, we're going to the Freedom Factory. Uh, we are doing spectator drags in the full-size truck class. F-150s, 250s, 2500s, that kind of stuff. That's all what's going to be in that class. Uh, we enter the shop truck. You'll see that. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy that footage. Uh, did really good. Not stuff going on over there. Well, I guess we're just gonna line them up. Hopefully, I don't run out of gas. No fuel lights on. That was a good choice. <laughs> well, you probably should have ate six inches of that sub instead of twelve, then. <laughs> traction in this old girl i can tell you that you didn't put it four no i got the front end cranked up i can't oh yeah she just spun off the line it looked good it launched hard it didn't feel good it felt very sketchy <laughs> we'll see we'll see what happens second round i don't know should i pull up i don't yeah i gotta move i think <laughs> second round dude was crushing it trucks faster way faster driver it happens but i did have some sketchy shit happen i don't know if you guys can see in the video but this thing the second round was just like wow. and then coming out of this uh turn two the front tire locked up because the traction control tried to work and so i was like oh boy this could be really fun and luckily we didn't crash in the wall or him so it was good but anyway so now we're gonna do the truck pulls all the freaking trucks showed up we got like 20 trucks lined up and uh they're all going to be doing the truck pulls should be pretty exciting a uh, lot a lot of big trucks here these trucks are make mine look like a freaking tiny little truck yeah so anyway so all the trucks are here it should be fun they're gonna do a bracket on those all the way down to the winner 
and then uh, then we do a uh, grudge tugs after that. So it's just one v one. Whoever wants to pull, whoever wants to pull. So. All right, so I figured it'd be a good idea to tell you guys how we set up the rules for the truck pull so you guys are getting ready to watch that happen. First of all, the way we drew the numbers for everybody, there was 19 trucks. We had everybody tell us, hey, if you want to call this guy out, they, we did first round call outs, had a few of those. Everybody after that chip, drew a chip out of a bag, and that chip got matched with the next number of chips. So you had one, two, three, four, five, six, that time, so on and so on. So that's how we did it. So I'm going to show you guys all the first round stuff. Everybody that pulled in the first round, I'm going to show you their pulls. And I'm going to basically skip to the final round where the last two guys made it. There's a lot of pulling. It would take a lot of time to put it into a video. Don't want you guys to sit here through the whole deal. But I put all the trucks on there. You guys can see everybody that pulled. A lot of big, nice freaking trucks out there. Um, and uh, really nice trucks. And I want you guys to know, too, that towards the end, that's when I took up, hook up the military truck to the winner of the uh, um, tug of wars. The reason I could not enter the truck in the tug of war was because the we made the tug of war fair by more fair by doing a V tread no added weight class. So that means you had to have a V tread tractor tire and you couldn't add weight. You couldn't add a bunch of weight to the truck in the bed stuff like that. A lot of guys do. We made it so you couldn't do that and uh, kind of tries to even the field up. So you're pulling truck against truck. You're not just losing because some guy loaded his stuff down with 20,000 pounds. But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoy the tugs. They were awesome. The guys did an awesome job doing them. Uh, the Freedom Factory crew helped me so much with them, uh, you know, hooking the trucks up, that kind of stuff, and uh, ran through them pretty good. But hopefully you guys enjoy it. A lot of nice trucks, and that's kind of the gist of the tug of wars that we did. And we have a lot more coming to the Freedom Factory later on.
guys gonna do? We're gonna send it! Full send!
see if Pit Viper can pull its weight. So they say. What's your predictions here? Oh, dude. Dragging his ass. Dragging his ass, he said. What do you mean? He's trying to go to the house. <laughs> You'll have that sometimes. You will have that on them bigger jobs. Yeah. I think we found the setup for the barn. I feel like this has to, somehow, some way, we have to get this to the barn just like this. I, I believe like so. This has to be done. So, for sure. Hey, you ain't talking all that shit. Well, dude, for once, it worked. That was not a bad uh, deal because I literally just pulled. Yeah. The truck that I just pulled, that big black truck, literally pulls everybody like he crushes it every single time so to pull him i feel really good about that that's pretty freaking awesome so very happy the tugs went great it was awesome time and uh 
I mean, what do you think? Is it good? I think it went awesome. Couldn't have went any better. Our, our counterweight was great. Yeah. So the guys, uh, there was a lot of trucks here as you guys saw earlier. Everybody's starting to clear out. A lot of big, badass trucks. And this thing pulled the biggest one out of them all. So super fired up about that. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching Jason's channel. We'll see you next time.